Hi guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, it's Sunday, happy Sunday. Um, my other computer that I just bought crashed. In fact, I love Mercury. I'm using one of my older laptops so I know the volume. Hold on. I don't know if you heard that, but I tried to clean it up a little bit. I know it's not that great. Um, but my electronics are just crashing with the energy. So it is what it is. There's nothing I can do about it. Good thing I got insurance. So I am going to um, just pull you um, two cards for today, for Sunday, and kind of see um, where you're at and what's happening in the world of the planets. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I got the goosebumps. So yeah, I, I guess it made sense, even though to some it might not. But um, let's see. Okay, let's see where where we're at. Uh, you know. And, and for those who are waiting on a video, I had to redo a couple. I have been up since 6 in the morning getting these done before the house gets crazy again. So I just literally did um, finished up the last four. I, I finished up a few yesterday um, in, the, in the ether. So I'm hoping I don't have to redo those. Or I'm, I don't think I will, but I don't want to say anything negative about that. Okay. Um, so it's going to be a couple hours though because the last one I just finished was a three hour upload all right for a 35 minute video and yes I went over I do go over on some don't get jealous don't get jealous okay sometimes people need that um and I believe that's all I have for an update so today I believe is what the 10th the 10th of March holy crap it's flying by it's flying by all right, see it March 10th, March 10th, what are we looking at, what are we looking at, what's happening, I wonder if it's going to tell me what's happening in their world versus us, <laughs> so we got the, the Wheel of Fortune reversed, all right, so, hmm, This is something not going in someone's direction for damn sure all day. Um, so whatever happens today in the next couple of days, whoever rolls around, whatever situation chip you're in, be smart. Because it looks like today is not the greatest day for something to... um. To work. Let me go for wheel reverse. Let me go for wheel reverse, please. Four cups reverse. So somebody thinking something's not going to come back around and today you're right it, it, it's not but don't you dare sit in this energy I don't know if it's the queen of swords that I mean the queen of cups that thinks something's not coming back around or that's my daughter guys hey sweetie I just got KK's text I'm just in the middle of working can I call you back I grabbed one. Tell her thank you. All right. I'll call you back. Love you too. Bye. For all my newbies, welcome, welcome. I love you, but I will always pick up my phone for my children. Okay. Anybody else now, but my children, yep. You'll get to know me. Um, But what this is telling me, we can see that. Okay. We have the Queen of Cups right here. So something's not going in her direction or whoever's thinking about the Queen of Cups is yeah, thinking like, damn. I missed an opportunity, but this is somebody's thought, okay? So it's like you're creating your own thoughts right now. So, yeah, it's the Knight of Cups, okay? So it's almost like somebody feels like they missed out on an opportunity with the Queen of Cups or vice versa. But that's just thought. But maybe the universe wants them to sit in this energy, wants somebody to feel like this. For some reason. Because she's not talking. Her lid's closed. 
but with the Knight of Cups here and the Hermit, it's like somebody doesn't want to be, somebody is no longer wants to isolate themselves, you know, um, they've been watching for a little while now. So that's the type of energy somebody's sitting in today. They think there's an opportunity that can't roll around, but I'm telling you with this wheel, how I worded it, you know, it might not. So hold on. <clears throat> All right. So nobody can flip this wheel around today. You, you can't. All right. It's the universe wants you in this energy for whoever, whoever this is for. The universe puts you right there. Okay. They, they want you to, I guess, wonder whether or not an opportunity is going to roll back around because there's obviously some, some karma that's attached to this clear as day for one group. There's no question. Somebody needs to sit in that energy. Let's see what else we're looking at. We got the high priestess and the child of wands, okay? So we have the high priestess is reversed. Somebody's not using their intuition here or there's a secret that needs to come out. But there's somebody seeking the high priestess. I don't know if it's linked or not, guys. I'm not going to read it as it is linked because I'm doing two different groups. And we got again, we got the high priestess reversed with the, with the page of wands, okay? So it looks like to me, the page of wands is seeking out something, but this person is not using their intuition. They're not seeking the right way. So whether it's you or somebody else, something's not being seeked out the right way. And if it is linked, you know, that's the energy they get for not using their intuition. It won't last long, but that's that is what that is, okay? But I'm looking at it as two groups. So let's find out, you know, what this is. So it's just the energy today, guys. So even with these being two different groups, I'm telling you, we still have a group here that's seeking answers. But it's like, you're not using your intuition the right way. Okay, so this is, it's, this is tough. It's, it's tough energy. Tell me about the high priestess. Hold on. So for some, these cards are linked, okay? But this is somebody not using their intuition. So it's like they're seeking answers but not using their intuition. So the universe is saying, sorry, you have to sit in this. I really wanted two groups, guys. I'm sorry. It's linked, though, okay? So this could be you. It, in any type of situation, it just looks like today is that type of day where, you know, if you're not going to use your intuition that's given to you when you're born then this is this is a consequence sorry about the high priestess whoa that came flying out and it's the nine of cups upright this is not a wish this is somebody who's smug wants to be catered to ungrateful okay so you were ungrateful for something the universe gave you an opportunity with some situation and you were ungrateful so the universe is going to make sure you're sitting in this heavy thought, okay? Because it looks like now somebody wants an opportunity, but you can't have it. Not today, you can't. There is some major healing that's required here. And somebody is arrogant. This is straight up arrogant. So tell me about the child of wands. So like seeking answers that I'm telling you, you're not going to find because you're not listening to your intuition. So the empress reversed with the chariot. All right. So there is like, they think they don't have a shot with the, with the empress. So somebody like 
this is feminine energy, you know, so it looks like, you know, the page, page or prince of wands, whatever you want to call it, is seeking out the empress, but the empress is, is moving forward. It, you could be dealing with an Aquarian or a Taurus, but right now it's like, you can't have it. Um, yeah, look at the emperor wants it back. But again, like there's something going on here. The Hierophant may be, you know, this could be saying too, if you don't want a serious commitment, the universe is saying you're not going nowhere near this Empress because it's an Empress. You're not playing games with the damn Empress. You can go kind of like kick rocks and sit in that energy. All right. Because you can't play games with the Empress and you're not using your spirituality. All right. It's, this Emperor is arrogant right now. This emperor is linked to this nine of cups. Okay. So look at him looking. But now someone's biting themselves in the ass. But it is what it is. The universe is saying you're going to sit in that for a little while. They do want to send a message. But honest to God, the way, this is, the way this looks, I'm telling you, the universe wouldn't even allow this message to go through. Somebody wouldn't even get the message. They, they got pull over electronics. Believe that. Okay. So this is um is this the Emperor seeking the Empress? Yeah, I just wanted to clarify. This is the Emperor seeking the Emperor the Empress, and they're like, you can't you can't have her because you didn't want to use your spirituality. You're not using your intuition. You're not using what you were born with. The magic you were born with, you could have abused. Okay, and and the Emperor is a little arrogant right now. And they're, they're seeking, you know, now this person wants to come in, Prince Charming wants to come in, but now instead of them being able to come in and send the message properly, the universe is going to let them sit in this. It's not going to work out, not today. Okay, there was an opportunity. It doesn't mean the opportunity would have worked out then, but the fact when the opportunity was there, instead of using your spirituality, using your gut, you were arrogant. So it's like you shut something down. Something happened where you were just all about yourself, sitting pretty on a throne. But now the universe is like, what goes around comes around. And it's just a daily energy or however long, long it lasts for you. The universe always wants to help you out. But today, this is the way it is. You can't get near the empress. You need to sit in that, that icky, the sorrow. Like it's not going to go your way. Okay. Um, and with the chariot here, moving forward, I, I basically, to me, it's just saying you can't move forward with the Empress right now, correct? Yeah, you can't. There, there's no way you can't move forward with this Empress. It's not, don't, it's almost like, until you can look at some type of journey seriously, it, it's, it's, it's a no-go. So it's like, you can go ahead and try to reach out. If you if you want to, but it it doesn't look like it will go in your direction. You're you're purposely in this energy. All right, you, you right now, someone can't touch the emperor. So if you're in a relationship and you're arguing, don't, you know, for the mama, the universe shut down the masculine energy right now because they're they're sitting in ick. Okay, so you keep moving forward because today is not the day to mend anything. This person, two of crystals at the bottom of the deck reverse anyway. It's like they don't even know how to make a decision. And it's the emperor right underneath it. All right. And that's what happens for sitting in that. Okay. And so. It looks like um, a tough day for some. All right. It's just, it is what it is. Something's not going to go in someone's direction, whether it's with this empress, a different, another empress, another person, it doesn't matter. Somebody misused their spirituality and didn't use their intuition in their gut and they were ungrateful. All right. And stingy and arrogant and it's linked to the emperor. So whether you guys are together or not, you know what I'm saying? Because it's a match. It's a couple. It's a husband, wife type thing. 
Um, and even if it's a meant to be scenario, it won't, it's not today. Today is not going to go in, in any good direction. They need to sit in that. They need to feel like they missed an opportunity. And they could have because this emperor, this empress is moving forward. This is, you can't have her right now. Sorry. She's so close to you though, but you can't have her because you're not using your gut. You're not, you're not, the masculine energy is not using their soul. So right now the empress is moving forward. Right now you can't touch her. She's off limits. So I really hope this energy flips for some people because that's, that sucks. Okay. But it is what it is. And she, and I got the goosebumps. She is highly freaking protected if that is the case. Because the universe is like, hands off. So even if you want this person to reach out, no, you don't. No, you don't. Because they got your back right now. And they got this person's back too. But in, in a way of whatever they're sitting in right now, thoughts, feelings, it, it's on them. They caused it. They put themselves there because of arrogance. Tell me about this four of cups. And that's the last one I'm clarifying. And then I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. Not the greatest. Uh, just, you know, not, it, it's just not grounding energy. It's, it's not happy. It's, it's, it is what it is. And you got the seven of pence reversed in, in the six of cups. So they're desiring their past. But, you know, will I ever be able to invest? Is, will this ever come back around? Will I ever have this? You know, I don't know. But you do have four fours sitting on top of, um, sitting on top of something not going in your direction. I believe all those fours talk about intuition. And I'm just going to look really quick because I know all the fours. Um, spiritual meaning of 44. I know all the fours. Okay, so it's like they want to give you that strength and energy, but right now they're, they're not letting you have it, okay? Because they've given it to you and you've been sitting on this basically is what it's saying. Okay, and it's like, and it's like, yeah, see, see, it's like the 44 is all about an indication about using your intuition, all right, and seeking what it is you want. And you're seeking because this, it says seek, this is the seeker, okay? But it's like right now you can't have that because of whatever experience you need to experience because there was, there was, a, because of this situation, because of that energy, all right? So it's like, it's amplified. So whoever's sitting in this, is is it's doubled emotions it's you know I, I just heard I, I can it's like I can feel somebody being like good don't don't be like that okay because you've all been in energy like that and it sucks okay but for some reason this it is what it is right now it's not going in this person's direction but it, you know you got to understand that the angels are with this person it's a master number guys it's all about balance too self-discipline reaching your goals achievement okay so it's like what they want, they can't have right this second because of how something went down. So it's it's part of their lesson, okay? But it's also a message of congratulations for, for hard work if you put the work in. So it's something coming in the future, okay? Because it is sitting on top of the Wheel of Fortune. It, this person just needs to sit in this now because the 44 is reversed on top of the Wheel of Fortune reversed, okay? So it's like, Coulda, shoulda, woulda. It, it doesn't matter anymore, okay? Um, the, the, eh, this energy needs to sit in this to really understand what it is they lost. Because right now, they lost the Empress. The Empress is moving forward in a new direction. So that means the universe is working with the Empress and making sure she moves forward. And they came out together. So she most definitely is moving forward. And now that she's moving forward... He's seeking her out. I mean, it goes like that, guys. Obviously, it happens. You know what I mean? But, like, this one's in a new direction. Why this one's in this direction right now? And this energy's only going to last for so long. This is an important lesson. 
It really is because you, is somebody here with the Hierophant and the High Priest, Priestess reverse was not using their intuition. They were arrogant. Okay. Maybe somebody just didn't want to be in a committed relationship. I, you know, to me, it's linked. It's like the tool you can be very spiritual too, but you didn't use it the right way. That's for damn sure. Because look at, look at this Empress reversed, looking straight down. Look at how spiritual this is. That's crazy. I didn't even realize that. It's, it's beautiful too, but look at that. See the Empress both looking up. Okay, the High Priestess and the Emperor. So it's like here these two are. Here these two are. Okay, right next to each other. So it's like you're both, it's like you're both spiritual, but one used their spirituality the wrong way. Okay. So it, it is, it is what it is. You will come out of this energy. You were dealing with somebody who was awfully arrogant, but as of right now, this emperor is being blocked from the empress. Okay. And, and they're in this thoughts of, you know, will I get that opportunity again? Can I have this? Because now they're thinking I could have. Now, how do I get there? Because they're seeking it. But if this is you, you're not using your intuition. I'm telling you right now. You, you, there's something in your life where you still have an attitude and you're still stingy. And the universe is like, there's no effing way you're coming near my empress, not my high priestess. Nope, she's going in a brand new direction because it's more beneficial for her. If that, I hope that makes sense to you guys. So even if this comes together at some point, and it looks like it can, because these are the two that can be flipped. But right now is not your day. <laughs> that is for damn sure. Um, tell me about this Empress real quick. <clears throat> That's too many. To me, it's like she's just, she's moving forward, and the universe is making sure she's moving forward. She's got no part of this energy. She's not in this energy. Yeah, she's not putting no effort into the King of Pentacles, so she's not part of this energy anymore. So, you know, she's she changed her perspective when it came to this particular person anyway, and moved forward. It came out that way, you know. So she she was enlightened or or something, or you're gonna be enlightened, the Empress. It's something like that, okay? It's like you're gonna be successful. You got the chariot and the six of wands. You're, you're going in a new direction. See what I'm saying? You're not even, you're not even with the king of pence, you're not even putting effort into it anymore. It is, you're just not. The empress is most definitely moving forward. There is no question. She's not arguing. She doesn't feel left out. There's nothing petty here. That was five, five, five. The empress, holy shit, five, five, five. Going places, major, major changes. You're no longer arguing. You don't feel left out. There's nothing petty going on anymore. You, you, you're just like some of you are in the public eye too. You know because you changed your perspective. You decided to move forward. You, you decided to put the weight down because this person obviously wasn't partaking anyway. Because it's reversed. So you're no longer even in this energy. And now this person is. But my Empress now holds the 555. That's major, major shifts, changes. It's gorgeous. Okay, this one will come out of it. It's just a matter of, of time. Hopefully, hopefully they come out of it. Because right now, this person is extremely arrogant. I don't know if somebody misused their spirituality. Because the both of you are spiritual, higher thought, and priestess. But what it's basically... Again, stressing is that this, the emperor is not using their intuition, didn't use the intuition the right way. And the world just flew out, okay? So, and it's upright. That's a completion. Some of you, you will not get this. It will not come back around. Because you didn't, you didn't take action. You know, you were, you were, some of you, you were just in and out. You, you can't even, you're passing judgment on yourself. It is what it is. One door shut for another one to open. And now because this energy didn't come in, and obviously it was probably meant to be, but because this energy didn't come in when they were and they didn't use the spirituality right, somebody is just in that energy. And the high priestess is moving. She's going places. It's completed. It's shut down. Can it come back around? Yeah, and work at another time? Yeah, maybe for some. Doors have to shut for another one to open. And I'm telling you, every single door shut 
for this particular group of mamas. So congratulations, because the door finally shut. My door shut. And I, the other day, and I was so excited. I was like, thank God. And with the world there, this mama is about to travel the world too. Six of Wands, the Chariot, and the world. Hello. That's a lot of travel. But basically, the door shut for a particular group of mamas, and they're moving forward. It, it's absolutely beautiful. And if somebody got left out of the situation, then it happens. Okay, because you don't want that emperor in your life right now anyway, because they're arrogant. They sit on their, prone, their throne like they're king shit. And the, now the universe is like, you're going to get a dose of your own medicine, which is unfortunate. So hopefully, hopefully this gets solved the right way. But if you ask me, this is something that doesn't even need to come back around because it's completed. So if it does come back around, you make sure you let bygones be bygones and you start fresh. I'll tell you that for damn sure. Okay. But it is shut down. So for those who wanted it completely shut down, congratulations. You're going in a new direction. You're, you're not looking backwards. You're only going forward. All right. So I love you guys so much. Have a fantastic rest of your day and I'll, I'll catch up with you tomorrow. Okay. Bye guys.